<sighs> Take a moment. See yourself sitting where you are. Take a deep breath in and out. In and out. We're going to reach down, reach down into the ground. So through the floors and through the cellars, all the way through the foundations until we're into the earth far beneath us. Reach down around the soil, around the rocks. Keep on going down deeper into the earth until we find the bedrock far below us. We reach down, we're going to search around until we find the pools of water, the waters of chaos, waters of potential far beneath the earth. We're going to start bringing those waters up, up through our roots and up through the earth, bring them up into our feet and into our legs. With each and every breath, we're going to pull those waters further and further into our loins and into our bellies. Breaths bring them up further into our chests and into our heads. We're filled with these waters as we breathe in. We bring more and more until it comes out of our heads and out of our hands. Water is coming up through our feet, running through our bodies and out through the top, flowing back into the earth with each and every breath. Feel these waters running through your bodies, the cool waters, waters of chaos, waters of potential running throughout our bodies. Take the energy, feel it, embrace it, enjoy it. Now we're going to turn our focus up, go up through the ceiling, through the roofs, all the way up into the sky, through the clouds, until we can find that one star directly above our heads. We're going to reach up, we're going to pull down the light from above, the fires, the fires of order from the stars above. We're going to pull that down, down into our hands and into our heads. With each and every breath, we'll pull this power down further into our bodies, into our chests, into our bellies. Next breath, we'll bring it down into our loins and into our legs. And following breath, we'll bring it down into our feet and again, flowing out the bottom. As with each and every breath, we pull the waters in from below and the fires in from above. Chaos and order, fire and water mixing throughout our bodies. Fill yourselves with these energies. Take of these energies all that you need. With these energies, find your center and recenter yourself. And fill yourself with all the energies you could possibly need. And now, keeping only what you need, push the waters back down into the earth. Push the fires back up into the sky. Disconnect from the waters below and the fires above. Feel yourself grounded and centered, and filled with all the energies you need for the rest of the night. And know that if you ever need to tap into these energies again, you can always reach down and pull it up, and you pull, reach up and pull it down. But for now, take a deep breath in, and out, in, and out. When you're ready, open your eyes, ready for magic. Our first offering, as always, is to the Earth Mother. Earth Mother, you surround us and support us. You aid us, you give us shelter, you give us food for all that you do for us, Earth Mother, accept our offerings. Earth Spirit, accept our offerings. <laughs> and the land spirit making noise upstairs. <laughs> we're here to honor the gods. And we're here to ask blessings from the kindreds, the shining ones, the land spirits, and the ancestors. But first, let us hallow our hallows. Mighty well, you run deep into the earth and connect us to the underworld, to the ancestors. We call on you, 
we give you silver today. We say sacred waters flow within us. Sacred waters flow within us. In mighty fire, you burn and transform. You send your offerings up into the skies, to the heavens, to the shining ones. We offer you this incense. We say sacred fires burn within us. Sacred fires burn within us. In mighty tree, your roots go deep into the earth and connect us to the wells and the ancestors below. Your branches go high into the sky, connect us to the shining ones above. We disperse you and we sense you. We say, sacred tree, grow within us. Sacred tree, grow within us. And my house and all of our houses, the light of the waters and the light of the fires, our groves are made whole and holy. By the might of the waters, the light of the fires, our groves are made whole and holy. By the light of the waters, the light of the fires, our groves are made whole and holy. So be it. So be it. And now we call the gatekeepers. Gatekeepers all, you have aided us throughout the years and opened the ways between the worlds. We call you once more to join us, to help us open the ways, watch over us as we walk your holy roads. Protect us as we do our works this evening. Guide us, take our messages far and wide and bring back all that we need to hear. Gatekeepers all, accept our offerings. Gatekeepers all, accept our offerings. Now, gatekeepers, join your magic with mine. Let the well open as a gate to the underworld. Let the fires open as a gate to the upper worlds. Let the trees be the crossroads between all the worlds, open to our spirits and open to our voices. Let the gates be opened. Let the gates be opened. Let be opened in our, my house and in all of our houses. Now we offer you the kindreds. Shining ones, you who watch over each and every one of us, our matrons and patrons, you of this very earth who are from where we live and to all of you who are unknown to us but watch over us nonetheless shining ones come to our fires shining ones accept our offerings shining ones accept our offerings and land spirits be you firm feather scale and skin or animal kin be you leaf and twig stem and flower our plant kin. And be you the unseen, all the spirits that inhabit our houses and the lands around us. To all of you, land spirits, come to our fires. Land spirits, accept our offerings. Land spirits, accept our offerings. And ancestors, be you of our family those of our lineage, be you of, this, of our chosen family, those who inspire and mentor us, and be you of this very place, you who are here long before us. Ancestors, come to our fire. Ancestors, accept our offerings. Ancestors, accept our offerings. At this point, if you have offerings of your own to make, please feel free to make them. Lady Breeze, I call on you once more to watch over those that need your help and protect those that need your protection. There are no more offerings to be made. Mighty Kindred, we give to you. We give to you one last time and ask the blessings in returns. Mighty Kindred, accept our sacrifice. 
Mighty kindred, accept our sacrifice. Mighty kindred, we ask, what blessings do we receive? The shining one. Shining ones give us Elhas, the elk sedge, protection. The land spirits. The land spirits give us Nalzis, the need fire, desires. And the ancestors. The ancestors give us Ingwas. The seed room, room of fertility and beginnings. I think this talks of creativity. You know what you need to do, what creativity has been calling to you. And the gods, Gods will have your back and watch over you and protect you as you're doing your creative ventures. I think this is a good omen. Do we accept this omen? I accept this omen. Ancient and mighty ones, we have given to you and good gossy tradition, a gift calls for a gift. We ask that you fill these waters, not just in my hands, but in all of our houses. Fill them with the omens we have just heard. Fill them with Elhas and protection. Fill them with Nalgis and the need. Fill them with Ingus and the futility to begin something new. Fill these waters and fill all of our waters with the omens. Behold the waters of life. Behold the waters of life. And now we thank all of those who have aided us. Ancestors, be you family, be you chosen family, or be you of this very earth for all that you've done for us and all that you do for us. Ancestors, we thank you. Ancestors, we thank you. Land spirits, be you the animal kin, be you the plant kin, or be you the unseen kin for all that you do for us and all you've done for us tonight. Land spirits, we thank you. Land spirits, we thank you. And shining ones, be you our matrons and patrons, be you of this very place, or be you unknown to us. For all of you that watch over us and all that you've done for us, shining ones, we thank you. Shining ones, we thank you. Gatekeepers, you have aided us once more. You have opened the ways. You've brought back these wonderful omens. We can't thank you enough. But for all that you've done for us, gatekeepers, we thank you. Gatekeepers, we thank you. Now, once more, join your match with mine in my house and in all of our houses. The well become but water. Fires become but flames, but the trees become but a tree once more. Let the gates be closed. Let the gates be closed. And last but not least, Earth Mother, without you we wouldn't be here. Your shelter, your food, and all the enjoyment that you bring as we walk throughout nature. For all that you do for us, Earth Mother, Earth Mother, we thank you. Earth Spirit, we thank you. And go now, children of Earth, in wisdom and peace, for this rite has ended. <laughs>